Hi friends, I'm Emily, this is All Bodies Welcome Yoga, that's Jolene. This is an accessible yoga space for folks who aren't interested or comfortable in fitness-oriented yoga studios. Please make sure that you like this video, subscribe to the channel, and you can even ring the bell icon to make sure you never miss a class. Leaving me a comment or sharing this video with someone or on social media is a great way to help this space grow. Check out more about my online virtual studio in the links below. Every subscriber to my Patreon gets a monthly newsletter playlist and members only live class, as well as the opportunity to request YouTube classes, get discounts on my group classes, first dibs on merchandise sales, and all of that cool stuff. If you wanna help support this work that I'm doing, subscribing to Patreon even for as little as $5 a month or leaving me a tip on coffee is a great way to do so and I really appreciate it. You can find out what is happening in All Bodies Welcome Yoga World by subscribing to my newsletter. The link is once again below. <laughs> and you only get it once a month. It is free. I will not bother you too much, I promise. Okay, thanks for listening and enjoy your class. Hey friends, I'm Emily and this is All Bodies Welcome Yoga and today's day eight of Disrupt Your Day. Today is going to be another meditation day. So you can sit for meditation or lay down, whatever is more comfortable. And if you are sitting, if you're on the floor, grab a cushion or something comfortable to sit on. You can also prop up your knees if your knees tend to start to feel um, overextended out of your hips. Or you can do this in a chair. Or again, laying down is great. Wherever you are, starting to close down the eyes. Letting the body start to relax. We're going to start by bringing our attention down all the way to our toes. And see if right now if you can feel your toes, if you can sense them in proximity to the floor or to the rest of your foot. Don't feel your toes, give them a little wiggle, then let them rest so you have that sensation. Rooting our awareness into the tip of each toe. Taking a big inhale and exhale, relaxing the feet. Taking a big inhale, spreading the toes wide and exhale, softening the toes, letting them rest. Bring the awareness up into the rest of the foot, the ball of the foot, the arch, the heel the top of the foot, around the back of the foot, up to the ankle. Noticing a few sensations in the foot. Again, if you have a hard time connecting with the feet, doing a little movement so you can feel them and then letting them rest. Noticing how the feet are in relationship to the rest of the body, where they are in relation to the floor. One big inhale, tensing the feet however you can, and exhaling, softening and relaxing the feet, letting them root down. And 
gently release up into the legs, the calf and the shin and the knee. Attention coming to the long bone of the leg. All the muscles supporting the skeleton here. The tendons and ligaments that are engaged around the knee. Noticing what you feel in the calves and the shin. And if you don't feel connected to them, giving yourself a little movement in the legs and relaxing so you can feel them present, supporting you. Finding a few things you can notice about this part of the body. a big inhale, tensing the bottom of the legs, and then exhaling, relaxing, softening the legs. And the awareness glides up to the thighs and the hips, the pelvis, the glute. Connecting into these spaces, noticing where they are, noticing the sensations around them. Taking any movement you might need if you don't feel connected to the legs yet. Trying to picture this part of the legs in 3D, not just aware of the back or the front, but aware of the whole width, the circumference of the body here. One more big inhale, tensing the body, the hips, the glutes, the thighs, and exhaling, softening, relaxing. Any attention comes up to the belly and the back. Noticing where your attention immediately falls and spreading that out so you can become aware of the full space of the belly, the exterior, the interior, and aware of the back. Noticing what you're feeling and what you might need to coax if you don't feel connected here. Imagining how deeply you can center yourself inside of the belly.
on this big inhale here. Exhaling, softening, relaxing the belly, the low back, the mid back. Bring the attention up to the shoulders, the arms, all the way down to the fingertips. Becoming aware of the different sensations here, the tenseness or the softness of muscles. where the hands are resting. Where the shoulders are sitting. And if you don't feel connected here, taking some small movements and then resting the body. So you become more aware. Matching the breath, reaching down the length of the arms all the way to each individual fingertip. deeply into the arms, tensing from the fingertips up to the shoulders. And a big exhale, softening and relaxing, gently resting. And our attention will drift up to the final part of the body, the throat, the jaw, the cheek the nose, the forehead, the top of the head and the scalp, becoming aware of all these different spaces across the face, all the tiny, tiny muscles that engage here for your expressions. Can you feel the back of your scalp, the back of the neck, the sides of the neck? up under and around the ears, adding any small movements you might need to become a little bit more aware. Each breath filling into these tiny spaces of our face. Big inhale, tensing as much of the face as you can. And then big exhale. Coming into a deep, aware stillness of every part of the body. Accounted for. Every part of the body relaxed and softened. Connected with the exterior of the body as well as the interior. We'll close this meditation with a big breath, big inhale, big exhale. And you can gently open your eyes. Thanks so much for practicing with me today and I will see you tomorrow. Bye.